The life of the well-renowned Flávia Junqueira Angulo, born in 1985 in the city of São Paulo, Brazil. Flávia is an artist with an extensive academic background, with a master's in photography and bachelor's degree in plastic arts granted by FAP, a well-renowned university in Brazil, a master's in visual poetry by the University of São Paulo, and a PhD granted by the University of Campinas. With her being such a well-known artist, Flavia has done many group exhibitions, such as Una Mirada Latinoamericana from the Photo España Project, and a very successful solo exhibition called Tomorrow I Will Be Born Again at Cidade das Artes. Her work varies between two main styles. The first one, the playful universe and accumulation of objects, an idea that emerged as part of her creative process and became one of her trademarks, and the appropriation of toys, which comes from the idea that children are permissão, in other words, allowed, to mix life and fantasy more freely. Flavia as well does portrait of herself into her art and mixes into both of her styles quite often. As you may have noticed from the pictures showing, showing in the video, some of her work are quite confusing and somewhat disturbing. Since we're talking about pictures of different locations, but with a twist in it, where you, whether you have an object or like, such as like balloons or a representation of Mickey Mouse or many different dolls into her work, which can cause a bit of confusion at first. But there is a reason behind it, especially when you come to the balloons, which is used more often than other objects in her pictures. Her work is nonetheless a metaphor for the empty promises of the consumer world, where the plenitude has lost its spiritual dimensions, being now replaced by the ambition of possessed material goods. The balloons, for example, would be the representation of a good that once it's popped, once it's once you acquire that good, it's empty in the inside, such as we are when we're looking for in a consumer market where everything is fast paced and all we want is the next big thing to have the next most technological thing where this leaf is empty in the inside without content. Same as the balloon. Once it's popped, it's empty. The two main piece of arts that call my attention and that I think I can most relate to class come from the same theatrical ideal. One is called Visual Poetry Developed from the Concept of Theater, with the piece A Criança e Sua Família, The Child and Its Family, in other words. This piece, as you can see, has a child laying down on a couch, holding her doll. This is a very disturbing piece and can really relate to the piece that we read of Amalia, the child who lost her mother, lost her father, well, and was going through many changes with people coming in and out of her life constantly. But one thing always stick with her, which was her doll. The doll that she also took until her late of death. When she melted, Amale also melted, which can be a good representation in connection to the picture that we see. The second piece is called Realidade versus Ficção Teatralidade. In other words, reality versus fiction in theater. These, it, this is actually two different pictures showing two completely different scenarios. When put together, it's clear that it's actually one picture due to the background. In the picture, we can see a woman holding hands to something at first and a teddy bear. And in the other hand, we can see a woman holding hands at something in the balloons, showing two different realities, which is clearly connected, could be, with the Black's Caltecas reading where the late the woman lived into two different realities. Thank you.